Today in this video we learn how to connect to a server with a double click. To do this we need an XML file. In my case I am using an online XML editor to write XML code to make sure XML is correct. Here if you see I am writing everything under the config tag. Under config tag we have general tag which holds information of username and password. Next I am creating tags as per the environment which holds information like server name and IP address. You can write the server name and IP address as per your need. Next, I'll copy this information and save it in a file with .xml extension. Now, we need a PowerShell script. Next, we will read the XML file using get content to load information of server, username and password. Now, I created three variables here, server, username and password. If you see the XML file, the server information is in config dot workstation and then name. Similarly, the username and password information is in config general username and config general password. Next, we'll simply print the connecting message. Next, we'll use the cmd key command and mstsc command to connect to the server. Now make sure you save the PS1 file in the same folder as your previous XML file. Now we need a batch script. Let's create a file with .bat extension and then we'll add some code to it. Here we simply we are simply calling the PowerShell script. So make sure that you enter the correct file name. Show tile. Now double click on the batch file and ta-da! 